Good morning. I don't usually talk this early in the morning. I just woke up. But today, because I hit 250 subscribers on Patreon, I would make a vlog. I haven't been making a bunch of vlogs, so I am new to this. So please have patience with me, this is going to be interesting. And, uh, yeah, I woke up like this. Good morning. Welcome to my bathroom. My tiny bathroom. What you doing? Good morning. I love you. So he's like, why are you making all this noise? It's usually quiet in the morning. I usually spend a lot of the morning not talking. I put music on. Oh my. This is going to be the most rambly vlog ever because I don't know what I'm doing and I am rambly. When I do normal videos, I edit my rambliness out, but I think the vlog is actually, the point of the vlog is to show my ramblyness, to show who I really am, it's just the real me. Are y'all ready for the real real? The reels? The reels of me? Are you ready for this? Can you handle this? I don't think you can handle this. I'm gonna put my contacts in. The cheap contacts because they're cheap. I can feel them inside of my eyeballs. The good contacts cost 10 times as much, but I cannot feel them inside of my eyeballs. I don't wear a lot of makeup anymore. I just kind of put some foundation on because i rather wear foundation than sunscreen. It's less oily. Mm. There you go. Okay. I don't know why, I just need a sound effect, a sound effect, ping, ping, sound effect, ping. So today is my quiet work day. It's my quiet work day, but I do have a lot of work to do. I am going to make a video or two for the Neurodivergent Rebel YouTube channel. I also have some other work that I'll do that I'll show you as well. I found that I absolutely have to have at least a couple days of week where I work and I just quietly work by myself on work because like I have to I have to manage and moderate my energy. So I have decided that for me the perfect formula has been oh my gosh this hair. <laughs> the perfect formula has been working and doing two days a week only of calls and engagements and activities with other people. Only two days a week I can really handle something like that. And then the other three days a week, a day where I do emails and banking and all the responsibility stuff, kind of boring stuff, you know. And then I have the usually Tuesday and Wednesday, maybe, or Wednesday, Thursday, or Tuesday, Thursday, where I do calls with people and live chats, things like that, where there's like socialization, human interaction. Then I have days like today and yesterday, uh, which are called, I call them my quiet work days, which is incredibly necessary for me. Otherwise I get burnt out. And now that I am Managing my own schedule, I am learning how to not burn myself out. Because before, I was doing things to neurotypical standards all the time. Make a mess. Make a mess. Tony, Tony, 
do 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 actually i normally would have music on now but if i put music on i can't share the video on social media because the music is going to be copyrighted so i have to sing it to you instead do 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 we do we do we do we do we do 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 we 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 I figured out that I can give up gluten and sugar and have no pimples, but giving up gluten and sugar is like giving up so many things. Uh, that's a big no thanks. I'd rather have pimples and gluten and sugar. Mm. Ah, popsicle. Ooh, popsicle. I want a popsicle. around with me long enough you realize I eat way too many popsicles. Sensory seeking out its finest right here. Cold, icy, crunchy, refreshing. This one however is not frozen correctly. It froze too fast and it doesn't crunch the right way. It's still good. Just not the crunch. I don't know. But now I'm awake more. Because it's cold, I'm stimulating my senses. Sugar. Okay. Maybe now I'll be awake and do something. I'm gonna draw my eyebrows. Brush my teeth. Eyebrows. Yeah. This. This is my eyebrow pencil. And these are my eyebrows before my eyebrow pencil. This is freaking magical. Watch. I'm gonna fill in this part here that is gappy and missing stuff. So I'm gonna go up from the bottom here. I don't know why it has that sound effect. Oh look, I have some eyebrow there. Wow, it's magic. Okay, now we'll do this one. I'm gonna fix that too. Following the hairs. Would you look at that? Magic. Okay, fine. Getting better. Ooh. Oops. 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 I made a mistake. I made a mistake. I made a mistake. Uh, the mistake. Gotta fix the mistake. I think that's eyebrowable. Looks like this one's darker than this one. Uh, I don't have a light when I'm looking that way, but this is kind of weird. Yeah, let's try this. Okay. Yeah. My face is done, that's it. That is it for my face. Now I'm gonna brush my teeth. It is sensory torture for me. Oh boy, I don't even wanna do this, but I got to because I like to have teeth. Electric toothbrush because I cannot stand a manual toothbrush. Like, uh, 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 no. Also can't stand the nail file. Same deal. Ah, toothpaste. This is gross. I hate this toothpaste. Recommendations welcome. If you have sensory friendly toothpaste or sensory friendly toothbrushing recommendations, please drop those in the comments below. I already know from talking to you humans out there in the internet, that I'm not the only person that struggles with this. Okay, time to do the not so fun thing. Come in here and uh, gross. Gross meets grosser. Here we go. Oh, I don't want to. Uh. I know that wasn't the full amount of time. Put my toothbrush as a timer. And I didn't make it to the end of the timer, but. I actually made it longer than I usually make it. I could not brush my teeth for as long as I'm supposed to brush my teeth, but brushing my teeth a little bit is better than not brushing my teeth at all. That is my argument. Sometimes I don't even get to brush my teeth for that long. Everything about teeth brushing is a nightmare from the mint to the slimy foam in my mouth to taste and the brushing back and forth. I hate it. Oh, my hair. I gotta figure out what to do with my hair. 
I should have plugged this in a while ago, but I didn't do things in order because I'm a little bit distracted by the camera, if I'm honest. It's uh, throwing off my very specific routine that normally has an order. I do the same things in the same order each and every single day because it helps me stay organized and not forget something. Uh, like to turn this on and let this warm up while I do the other things I already did. So now this is cold and I have to wait for it to warm up. I'm gonna put some music on. I need music. I just got a new haircut recently and I have really been struggling. I don't know what to do with it. It is giving me many troubles. Many troubles. I just don't know how to style my new hair. I really don't know what to do with it. Uh, I don't know. I'm just making stuff up and I'm about to get the hairspray out because I don't know what else to do. Punk rock, style it straight up. That's what my hair's trying to do. I mean, it's Friday. I literally don't know what to do with my hair, except clip it back. All that effort, and I'm just going to clip my hair back. All of that effort. And I just gave up and clipped my hair back. I really, really need this not to be crooked. I really need caffeine right now. So I'm gonna do that. This is what I'm doing today. Not particularly fancy, but just as good as Starbucks in my opinion. Mmm. Instant! Oh, sorry, Rocco. Sorry, Rocco. I kicked my dog in the face. I kicked my dog in the face! I really do have solo dance parties in my house by myself. Every day. my coffee so it's time to get to work right yes yes coffee means I can work now welcome to my desk place where you humans 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 words the place where you humans are used to seeing me so today now that I'm more awake I will be creating shooting and editing videos for the neurodivergent rebel blog and channel I also uh, have been working in VR. So I'll be doing a little bit of testing and writing some notes uh, because I was sent a headset to do some testing and I have really thoroughly been enjoying playing in VR. This is addicting, dangerously addicting, so much fun. I think what I might do first is do some of the VR testing I need to do. I have multiple projects I'm working on right now in my consulting job that are related to educational experiences in VR. This is the future and it's really exciting.
one of the cool things about this is something I'm not beta testing, but is in here is this exercise program where I punch these glass orbs. I don't know what they are, but it is so much fun and very addicting. And the next project I am going to start, it's not supposed to start for 15 minutes. So I have three minutes to do an exercise in VR. So I'm going to do that. Sensory seeking in virtual reality. Ugh. Okay, I'm gonna need these though. These controllers, I'm gonna need these. Also, I'm attaching them to my hands because I'm very worried I might throw them and break them. I'm so addicted to this. This is so much fun. Like, I'm really hooked. Really, really hooked on this. It's really cool. Although I always do the same exercise every time. True to my autistic nature, I use the same song every time. down. That was great. So cool. There are other worlds. You are in another world. You can visit other parts of the world. It's wild. Okay. I am really officially hot and sweaty now, but that was fun. Fun. Fun, fun, fun. So it's almost nine. My calendar says that is when I need to start shooting my videos. It's also when there will be enough light coming in to where I don't have to use this big artificial light. It's getting a bit better. Before I get started, I'm going to call David. Uh, and where is David, you may ask? Well, it's Friday. Uh, and currently David is at work, not physically here. Well, that's why I'm running around talking to myself as I do when David is not here. But you're here, so now I'm talking to you. So it is not just the dogs that are listening to my rambling. I'm back in the bedroom because before I get to work, I think this is an excellent opportunity to give you a tour of the RV. Dusty has already started the tour. Perhaps I should follow. This is our tiny and somewhat messy bedroom. No, I did not make the bed when I got up this morning. This is real life. It isn't usually made. This is my tiny bathroom where I get ready every morning. David is banished to the even tinier bathroom because I am a mess and take up all of the space. Yes, I will admit that. This is our kitchen. Need to wash that. This is the fridge. This is the other part of the kitchen. We have a microwave. This is our living room. And this is where I work. This is about it. This is the entire house. Two dogs are outside, two dogs are inside. That's all. Great day for a tour. Uh, disclaimer, the house is not usually this clean. Like this is abnormally clean. So I said, oh, it's a great day for a tour because the house is much cleaner than usual. Welcome to this. This is not reality. It is not usually this clean, but that's why I'm kind of glad there's some mess here to like show. Okay, it's not perfect, but it is usually worse. I'm about to start editing videos. But I wanted to show you my office mates who are here while I'm making videos, making noise in the background. There are many cuts and pauses because of all of this rambunctiousness. One is actually outside right now. That is the reality of a bit of the behind the scenes. I am working in an RV with four dogs and sometimes one other human. Like I said, David's at work. So right now I am the only humanoid creaturism. Here, right now, yeah, this is awkward. A little bit about my setup. This is a nice laptop. Uh, I had to get it when I worked for the consulting company and I'm so glad I did because it is 
what powers everything I do. I couldn't do my blog without it. This is a really cheap, flimsy thing. But it's awesome. I think it was like $15. You really don't need the best, most expensive equipment. This is the microphone I have. I was paid for a voice acting gig. That, uh, part of the payment was this microphone, which is a fantastic way to get paid. This is a great microphone. Great microphone. I love it. You don't have to have the best phone, the best anything to do. In fact, when I started my blog, almost all of my videos were originally shot on an iPhone 7. And I am shooting this on an iPhone right now. And it is not the latest and greatest iPhone. It's a decent iPhone. It's newer because I broke my 7. I drop this phone a lot. I drop it all the time. I am a disaster. I can not keep from dropping things. The good news is my coffee is now cool enough to drink. All of the tiny marshmallows, however, have melted. Yum. I hear a dog barking outside. Let's get dusty. It's just a short walk over here. Uh, hey. Hi, Bobby. Let's go. Here he comes. He's my boy. It's dusty. Awesome. I'm gonna turn off some lights now. I had these lights on for the tour. The grand tour that took all of two seconds. I, what was it, 45 seconds? It was a short tour. So I think it was like less than a minute. Front to back. Whoa! I don't even have my roller skates on. I roller skate in here. I totally roller skate in here. here but I've gotta to get to work. I've gotta do some work. This vlog has been a distraction from a lot of the work. I need to get to work. What am I doing today? Oh, yeah, that's gonna be an intense topic. Hey, humans on the internet, Lyric here. See, I'm gonna do the words, words. Oh, let's try this again. All right, hey, internet humans, Lyric here. Some of you may already know me as the neurodivergent rebel. I wanna do that again. I think that was just a warm up. I haven't shot video in a while. I think the last time I shot videos was like two Mondays ago. Oh, okay, I'm so glad I did that again. I feel a lot better about that one. I'm supposed to be working, but can we take a minute to stop? And I want to share with you how amazing this glittery ball is because I love it so much. Sometimes when it works correctly, it lights up. This is like some random $5 thing I found at the store that gives me so much joy. And I'm trying to learn like, hand, 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 hand tricks with it. I don't know what it's called, where you do tricks with the ball on your hand. I've got one that's a glass one that if I drop on my floor in this bus will break my floor and probably the ball. So that one's only for, a not here. I need to practice first so that I'm not dropping this one before I use one that's breakable, but oh, there it goes. It actually worked. It lights up and it's so stimmy and sparkly. It matches my hair when it's fresher. I love this thing. This is my workspace. Welcome to my workspace. This is going to hang out with me in my workspace. I've got this thing I need to take a picture of for social media. It's here so I don't forget because otherwise out of sight, out of mind. I've got my note cards for the next in-person presentation in a couple weeks. I'm really excited about that one. I've already practiced it a few times. Uh, so like I've got all of my things I'm working on here like visibly in the open so I don't lose track of them and I know where they are. Fridays I usually pack everything up and put it away. I've got this box. Let me show you the, 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 the ADHD box of shame. Let me grab my box. The box of things. I'm not going to open this box. Well, maybe I'll open it, but no. Yeah, I don't even want to look in there. This is a box full of papers and mail and things I need to deal with. It used to be a much smaller box. This box is growing because I am not tackling the things fast enough. Or if things are growing faster than they're getting done. I've been a little overwhelmed lately. When we move the RV, everything has to be put away. I can't have things up because we're going to be driving. So everything has to have some sort of a place. 
where it can be safe. And this box is stashed back on the dresser in the bedroom. I'm gonna go put it back now. You see all that in there? Oh boy! I don't wanna deal with this or have the willpower to deal with this right now. So it's going back to the room. Goodbye, box of shame. Okay, I'm back. We're gonna pretend we never saw that box, right? Just kidding. We are laying out all the dirty laundry today. All, all the dirty laundry I can think, think of. The other thing is I have note cards for my presentation. Even though I've, I know all of the things, I can't know the order I need to say things. And I worry I will forget things that I need to say. And the sequencing isn't there without some bullet points to keep me in order. So this is my note cards. On Zoom, it's actually much easier. Like it's, it's so much easier actually for me to give a presentation on Zoom, uh, but it's different in person. I think it's good. A lot more work for me though as an autistic person to do an in-person training versus a Zoom training. Way more work, way more energy, especially if you have to travel. I haven't been on a plane in a very long time, uh, but we are taking the bus down to the coast for me to do some training for an organization in, in a few weeks. I am struggling with bouncing back and forth between two cameras right now. And I did not hit record on the laptop <laughs> for that whole first part of that, or the second part of that video. I just realized, I was like about to go stop it and I realized it wasn't even recording. <laughs> So I'm exporting my movie from iMovie now that I've shot the video and edited the video. Next, I'm going to put the video into a program called Descript, which is what I use to create ca closed captions, captioning, and transcriptions for all of my videos. It is one of the first things I bought was a subscription for Descript when I uh, started Patreon. It was one of the first goals I had was to get this program so I could caption the videos. Captioning this video is going to be a lot of work. Captioning videos is actually really hard for me. One of my additional problems is I have really bad audio processing issues where I don't process or hear things word for word. I also think visually more in pictures and videos, not in words. So trying to transcribe something when that's not how I think is really difficult. So I use Descript and it still takes me a while. It's gonna take me a few hours. Before that, it was taking me hours to do a three minute video. And I have shot a 15 minute video and it will take me hours to do that. But if I would have had to do a 15 minute video without help, I would be crying. I would be crying. I cannot transcribe these videos on my own. And Descript does not pay me to say this. I am just saying it is the solution I found that worked well for me. As I am waiting for this video to export, I'd love to talk about Patreon for a minute because that's why I'm doing this video. I promised that when I got 250 subscribers on Patreon, I would do a vlog style video so that you could get a behind the scenes peek into my life. The Patreon members get a bit of a behind the scenes peek into my life because I do Patreon stories, which is like Instagram stories and it vanishes every 24 hours. Uh, but the rest of you really only see my polished and finished content a lot of the times. Unless you follow me on Instagram, because I do do Instagram. I do do. Do do. No, I don't. <laughs> I don't do do on Instagram. <laughs> I do Instagram stories too, but not as frequently as I do Patreon stories. I do more on Patreon than I do on Instagram. That do do thing really distracted me. <laughs> what was I saying? This video is only halfway to the export. It's not when you're done yet. Uh do do no what was i saying though what was i saying what was i saying that's gonna be in this that's gonna be this whole blog what was i saying what was i saying what was i saying i'm a disaster welcome to my life oh i was talking about patreon yeah so this is like a thanks to the patreon subscribers making this video but i am gonna share it with everybody in the public uh, Patreon members get a lot of videos first as a thanks as well. Uh, and if you subscribe at Patreon, it's patreon.com slash neurodivergentrebel. 
it is as little as a dollar a month. I have it a pay what you want subscription, minimum of a dollar a month, because I think that's as low as I can go uh, on the platform. And if you subscribe annually though, you will get uh, a discount. It, it can be less than $12 a year if you pay an with an annual subscription. It's really cheap. And if people feel like doing more, they can always do more. But the main thing for me is I wanted it to be really affordable and everyone gets the same exact benefits, regardless of what they decide to subscribe at. Patreon or not, like I'm grateful for you. If you are here, if you're watching this video, hanging out with me while I ramble on about nothing and edit videos and can't even figure out what was I saying? And you're here? Thanks. Wow. I'm surprised. I, I thought I would scare people away in the first two minutes of this video with all of the rambling. Oh, my video export has been successful. Now I've got to get back to work. It's lunchtime and my contact lenses are already burning. I cannot wear them. That is the problem with the cheap contact lenses. I can't wear them for very long. Okay, back to transcription. I really need to hurry up to finish transcribing this video. I've got five minutes left. I've been transcribing 10 minutes of this video for I don't know how long now. I should have kept track. It's been a while, it's been over now. It takes forever. done editing that video and doing the transcription and now I'm exporting it which takes a while and then I'm going to upload it to the Patreon subscribers, the YouTube channel members, and the Facebook subscribers who get the videos early. This video is not coming out for at least another month uh, but the subscribers get it now. Waiting, waiting, waiting. getting one video out with this vlog. So I can kind of do two things at once, but not really. That's it. That's a wrap. That's my day. I am done working. I am ready to start my weekend. If you found this vlog interesting and want me to do it again, give me a thumbs up. Let me know that you liked this video. And maybe I'll do another one where after I log off, I will share my weekend with you. Let me know if you'd like to see my weekend. Drop a comment if you want to see that. Let me know what other kinds of vlogs you might want to see me do in the future. All right, humans, I will talk to you next time. Bye.